Hello everyone and welcome to part 26 of my get to work let's play. Um, we are here with Reese in the hospital today and he's just about to start his shift and I figured we would try and cure Matteo today because he, he, he's he been in the hospital a while and I'm just wondering who this is, Kiera Grogan, we've never seen her before at work, I don't know, is she an elder? She looks, yeah she's an elder but she's got custom content really nice blonde hair which looks hilarious. Um... Weekly weak diagnosis available. Right, the minimum amount of exam data is in for Matteo. Reese can try to diagnose his ailment or run further tests. I think we're going to run some more tests. So let's swab him for a sample, and we're going to discuss his general health. Poor old Matteo has been in ages, and I feel like we should then do Genesis maybe because she's been here a while. Ah, <laughs> a viable tissue sample was successfully collected. So we're going to analyze his um, sample. Poor old Matteo. Who else have we got in the hospital today? We have um, oh, I can never pronounce her name. Mikey, I think. I'm not sure. And then we have Max East. And then we have, oh, Eliza Pancakes is here and Genesis is here as well. So a lot of the police force are not very well. Oh, and we've got little Martina, who we already cured once and she's come back. So I don't know if that's a good sign about our skills as a doctor or not. Perform a treadmill test on a patient. Now, we haven't um, done this before because we unlocked this at our last promotion. So let's, maybe we could try that. So to perform this interaction, use social referral to this object on a patient. Okay, so let's um, do that then. Medical referral. Let's refer for a treadmill test. Don't know what the treadmill test entails, but oh dear, that doesn't look like it's going well. Ah, uh, inconclusive. Or oh, this lady is like really working hard. I don't think good for her in her old age. She hasn't let herself go. She's keeping her hair nice. <laughs> Right, you work it. Oh, actually, someone's doing some work in this hospital. Megan Khan. There's a lot of elderly that work in this hospital. The custom content is strong in this part, it seems. He's got custom content t-shirt. Um, I don't know about these trousers. No, I think they came with a patch or a pack. I'm not sure. I think they are game trousers, though. Correct me if I'm wrong. So let's perform this treadmill test and we're going to try and diagnose him. The results of the treadmill test on Matteo indicate a possible ailment. Continue with examinations and test if diagnosis is not rendered. Okay. So let's... um. Ooh, compelling diagnosis. Let's just... Oh, we need to admit him to an exam bed. So oh, why don't you go here? Uh... Readmit patient. Okay, so he is doing that, but he's... Come on, Mateo. Let's check this patient's ears while we're waiting. <laughs> Come on, Mateo. Get back into bed. Okay, he looks like he's going, so that's good. We will... No, no, this room. Oh gosh, come on, Mateo. Oh, this is so annoying. Okay, let's cancel out that interaction, see if we can get him to go to bed. Eliza Pancakes has no brain. I don't know how we're going to cure that. <laughs> Mateo, go back to bed. Ah, oh, it looks like he might be going. Oh, I think Reese himself is not very well. Decent diagnosis chance. So we're going to... 
check Mateo's eyes. But I think we're ready to diagnose. We've only got one option, so that's pretty um pretty good evidence, I think. So we're gonna diagnose him with starry eyes. Oh dear. Diagnosis rendered. Now that Reese has diagnosed Mateo, he can proceed with a treatment on the exam bed. Okay. Oh, he seems a bit stressed out. Let's um treat him with starry eye meds. Hopefully this works, fingers crossed. We are ill. We've caught something from one of our patients. Yay, we did it. Check us out. We are awesome. Patient cured. Right. Okay, so let's... Um, we've got... A, ooh, no, we're not going to... We've got two options with Eliza at the moment. So let's analyze her sample. See if that will help. Oh, bless him. He's ill. We could order some medicine. I like that, we're ordering medicine even though we are in a hospital. Oops, no, I don't want to place in word. I always do that with the medicine for some reason, I don't know why. Poor old Reese, he's sick, but he still managed to get to work and get in there. This machine looks like it's like smoking, I'm not sure that's a good thing. The testing of Eliza Pankett's tissue sample in the chemical analyzer was successful. The results strongly indicate presence of an infectious disease which Re Reese needs to diagnose and treat. Ooh. So let's um, discuss general health. Oh, that's the wrong sim. Whoopsie, we want to talk to Eliza. So we're going to discuss her general health. And we're going to scan her body and we'll check her eyes and see if we can get some more evidence to see what's wrong with our Eliza. Oh dear. Successful diagnosis achieved. All examination results for Eliza Pankick are conclusive. Reese can now diagnose her ailment at the exam bed. Oh, awesome. So we're going to guarantee that she has got gas and giggles. And we're going to treat her for it. So we're going to prescribe some medication. Oh, we are having a super day. I wish our performance would go up a little bit more, though. Patient cured. Awesome. So let's um, log our results. And then I think we're going to let him have a little lunch. <laughs> so uh, we're going to buy a sandwich. So which of our co-workers are here today? Oh, we've got a bit of a queue forming. We've got Jose... Um, looks like it's Jose, Kira, I don't see there many other people working here today. And our orderly, who is, who was her name? Megan, that was it. Oh gosh. <laughs> Did she just age up? What a nice place to spend your birthday. Yeah, Genesis is now an elder. What a wonderful place to spend your birthday. I don't think we're going to get promoted because our performance hasn't gone up, but we should get a really good jump, hopefully. I think we should add Kira and Megan to our group and then we can talk about um, clubs with them. So we're going to talk about the medics. Hopefully we can do that before we finish work. I don't know if we will. Let's cancel the sandwich, I think.
Yes, we did it. Earn 1,000 club points. He's had 691 so far. And lead a club with 8 sims. Okay. Well, we've got enough maybe to unlock another member. Oh, we haven't got another one to add. But I'm not going to extend his work day. He has had a very good work day. So Reese did a fantastic job today. Promotions and community health are surely in the future. And he had 510 simoleons. Awesome. Okay, we're back home and we're the only ones in. So I think we should probably have a club gathering. Oh, we did get a big jump actually in performance. So that's brilliant. And he hasn't got to go work now for three days. So let's... What's that in his inventory? So he's still got a full sandwich in his inventory so let's put that in the fridge um let's go and have a gathering uh, let's have a gathering of the medics we're going to gather at a cafe I'm going to kick off some of these because I feel like we don't really go to the places where that's suitable. So we're going to have be friendly. We're just going to make it quite sociable. We're going to have be funny. And we're going to have... Um, play pub games. Just in case we end up anywhere with those items. <laughs> what are you doing, Reese? Where oh, you're exercising. Okie dokie. Why don't you have a little chat with Shirley? We're going to... No, we're not going to give her medical advice. Oh, Luna, I can't get out of my mind lately. Want to go on a date and have some dinner at the Diving Pelican? Mm, no, we're kind of at a club gathering. I feel so mean doing that, but I want him to get his points. We're going to hip bump, Shirley. I don't know why. And we're going to gossip about co-workers. Oh, we're going to talk about grilled cheese. And we're going to have a little gossip. And we will have a deep conversation. And, oh, he's glowing green. Oh, no. We have an inside joke. Oh, gosh. Jeez. I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. <laughs> we'll share a little secret with Shirley. Maybe not that we're an alien. That's kind of a big secret. <laughs> we're going to get to know her. Discuss interests. Oh, she's a genius. Oh, Rebecca's earned 765 simoleons. She is really good. Let's bring her here. How is she doing at work? Not so great because we really need to solve another case. So we're going to get her to come here. And play darts with... Um, why don't you play darts with Ty? Oh, he's quite good friends with Shirley, actually. Are you in our group? No, you're not in our group. Oh, let's get a game of foosball going. We're going to play with... Um, let's play with Shirley, Emma and Jose. He's like so energised. Rebecca's having a little gim dart. I hope that builds her fun. It looks like it is, so that's good. I think she'd be good at darts. I don't know why. She's just giving me that vibe. It's the girls versus the boys. Oh, we're getting points like mad. That's good. Uh, 
Lydia brought home 432 simoleons and earned a vacation day. Let's bring her here. <laughs> Liza. Oh, she's such a weirdo. And we're going to change into one of our new everyday outfits, actually. Um, let's go for this one. So she's got a green wrap top with long flowy sleeves, some sort of uh, grey jeans all torn up and some cool boots. I think she looks awesome. <laughs> so let's get her to... Um, Let's go to the cafe side and order some food. So we're going to give this lady a cheerful intro. The barista is currently too busy to take another order. Well, <laughs> I'm sorry, but <laughs> this place is empty. So I don't accept that. We're going to order a croissant. Rebecca, how are you getting on with the darts? Are you winning? Oh, she's happy with her successful interrogation. Oh, God. She nearly killed that guy. No, you're not going home. Why are you going home? Oh, she's saying goodbye to Ty. I don't know why. Rebecca, why don't you go and join your sister, actually? She's sitting in the cafe. On her own, probably. Oh, no, she's not on her own now. Dina Caliente has come to say hello. We're going to tell our sister an engaging story. We're going to tell all about our day. We'll have a deep conversation with her. We'll give her a little hug. And we will have a deep conversation. Reese is still playing his foosball. I want him to talk to Jose a bit. Their friendship has gone up, so that's good. I'm loving him in his pink lounge suit. Very trendy. <laughs> oh, this cafe is getting a little bit busy. Lydia, what are you doing behind the counter? You don't belong behind there. I'm going to propose her a crazy scheme. Flatter her and brighten her day a little bit. Well, poor old Reese sat here on his own. Why don't you talk to Ulrike? We're going to give her a flirty intro. He's just going to feel confident. Oh, no, because Emma's here. Oh, 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 oh. No, we're not going to do that. Whew, we give her... Oh, no, I clicked it again. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, let's give her a friendly intro. Friendly intro. We don't want to upset Emma. We're going to tell her a funny story. Um, we'll have a little gossip with her and we'll discuss fitness techniques and we will get to know her. Oh, we seem to be having a little chat with Dina Caliente. Where's Lydia gone? Oh, she's outside on her own, bless her. She's always alone, this girl. Um, What does she want to do for her trait? She wants to finish reading free books, but last time we came to a cafe, the bookshelf was empty and there doesn't seem to be one here. So let's pop a bookshelf in. Uh, we'll just get one of these, I think. Um, actually, let's go for this. Oh, it doesn't fit. There we go. Bed is empty, though. Read. Oh, it's not. Let's go read. Reel her in. Rebecca's eating pancakes. Are they in her inventory then? Okay, you can eat them then. That's fine. Oh, Reese, where did Ulrike go? Aww. Why don't we join this game then? Uh, challenge Sim. We're going to challenge... Who is it that's actually playing? Sergio. Oh, 
Ooh, he's feeling very confident. Hey, he just walked off. That's so mean. Let's get the group to play together then. Hopefully they stop playing foosball. <laughs> Oh good, they're all playing together, that's cool. <laughs> Did you just fart? Oh man, that is so grim. Lydia, how are you getting on with your book? Oh, you're having a drink as well. She's having a... oh, it doesn't say. Where are you going? Why do you keep standing outside? That's odd. <laughs> She's gonna sit here. Oh, that's quite cute. She having an espresso and just watch Reese playing. Maybe she secretly likes Reese. I think they'd make a cute couple. We're going to discuss fitness techniques with Ty because clearly he doesn't really um, have any. <laughs> uh, we apparently work with him then because we can complain about work. Oh, Reese, you really need to use the bathroom, dude. I think we should probably head home soon, but I, I kind of want Lydia to finish reading her book. She's so sweet. And she looks really happy reading as well. Oh, I think we're going to send Rebecca home and we're going to send Reese home and I just want to um, let's end this gathering. I want Lydia to finish reading her book. Come on, let's, let's finish this book and then we're going to head back home. There we go. So she has now read one book. So we're going to head home and I will join you there in a moment. Okay, guys, I'm back in the house and Lydia is just having a shower. Oh, the toilet's broken. And then she's going to have some fish tacos. Um, Rebecca's watching TV and eating and then she's going to go to bed. Reese is eating an oatmeal cookie that Rebecca made. I don't think that's going to get his hunger up as high as I'd like. So, oh, the tea maker's broken as well. So we'll get him to repair everything around the house. This is another of Lydia's outfits. A little black dress with some black sandals. She looks so cute. I'm thinking of having a little, maybe she's got a little crush on Reese, and she's, but she's seen him with all these girls and he's like, oh, he's never going to be interested in me. Why would he be interested in me? I'm a bit of a social outcast and a bit of a nerd, but I think Reese just has never thought of her in that way. And maybe, maybe one day in the future, there could be a little thing between them two. So Rebecca, you're going to go to bed. Oh my god, the house is just falling to pieces. So Rebecca, get yourself to bed. Poor old Reese. I hope he doesn't electrocute himself. We're going to get um, Lydia to mop like mad. She's thinking about working out. Hmm, maybe we should get her to work out. We do have a treadmill now. We bought one. Let's get her to do an energized workout. Why not? She's not really that fussed about working out but everybody likes to keep healthy I guess we're gonna scavenge for parts just to sell make some cash why not
poor old Reese doing all the household DIY at 2.30 a.m. in the morning. How are you doing, Lydia? I think we are. Oh, did, did anyone work on a Saturday? Nope. Nope. Only Rebecca works today. Let's see. Has everybody got Sunday off? So, Reese doesn't work Sundays. Rebecca doesn't work Sundays neither does Lydia so I think we will go to work with Rebecca I wanted to go with Lydia but she's not going to be at work so we're going to go to work with Rebecca again I know it seems like we only did that in the last part but um, we will do that and then we will have a Sunday off with the whole gang will be off so that's awesome Well, at least he doesn't have work so he can stay up quite late tonight getting all this stuff done. £90 for all those upgrade parts. Pretty good going. Poor Lydia. I think you should push the limits because you were close to getting a skill then. Oh, Reese stinks. Yuck. There we go. She got her level two. So I think we're going to let her go to bed now. Poor Reese, he absolutely stinks. <laughs> but I think I'm going to end this part in a moment when everybody's in bed and I'll start the next part with Rebecca and we'll be going to work with her and um, then we'll probably go to work with Lydia the next available day after that because we haven't done that for a while and I really want to get her a promotion so Reese is currently level 4, but quite close to level 5, which is really good. Rebecca is a level 5, and she needs to solve two cases. We've done one, and Lydia is level 4, and also quite close to level 5. So hopefully, sooner rather than later, we will be at level 5 in all careers. And I think that is a pretty good progress so far, and I'm really, really pleased. So um, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a big thumbs up and drop a comment below or if you've got any suggestions or if there's anything i'm missing or i'm you know not aware of that you think might be useful for this um let's play then let me know that'd be awesome and i will see you in the next part um and please subscribe if you haven't already i think i'm getting close to 100 subscribers which would be amazing if i could hit 100 subscribers that would be awesome so i would Love it if you would subscribe. Thank you so much um, and I'll see you in the next part. Bye.